Several people, including the Chicago firefighter, are taken to the hospital after a fire at an assistant living facility in West Rogers Park. CBS 2's Mugo Adigwe shows us the damage. I want to show you what the building looks like right now. If you take a look behind me, you can see up on the sixth floor, part of the wall is blackened. We are told that unit is where the fire started, but luckily it was contained to that single unit. Three people, including two residents in the building, were taken to the hospital. One firefighter was also taken to the hospital. The building is called the Schwartzburg House. It's an assisted living facility run by the Council for Jewish Elderly. There are 100 units here, but the fire, which started just before 8.30 this morning, was contained to just that one unit on the sixth floor where it started. She had put something on the stove and then turned the stove on, and she shouldn't have put that on the stove and heated it up, and it started the fire. Chief Robert Jerwitz says residents were asked to shelter in place as fire crews worked to put out the flames. This is a senior building, so to get them out, it's quite a challenge, especially going downstairs. So we, we had them shelter in place. They were fine. The alarm system here works perfect. The sprinkler went out right in front of the apartment, so it didn't. there was no, no problem with the fire stain in the apartment. We Again, we're told those three people who were taken to the hospital, two residents, one firefighter for a minor injury, are expected to recover. In West Rogers Park, Mugodigwe, CBS 2 News.